Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven, and in today's video, I would like to show you a few tricks on how you can link the pages in SharePoint Online. Um, so here's a scenario for you. Um, I have a site over here. It could be a team site, a communication site, and let's say you have a number of pages and you want to link them all up. And in my particular case, it doesn't have to be obviously in yours, but in my particular case, I'm building like a table of contents. Uh, I want uh, all these different links to different pages I have uh, on this particular site. Uh, so just to show you uh, all the pages I have, I only have a few. Uh, if I go to gear icon, site content, site pages, these are the pages I have. Here is my main one, home page, and then I have a page for HR benefits and a page for HR policies. I want to link them all up uh, from this page. So let me show you uh, two cool ways to do so. So you uh, click the edit button, and let's just say you know I want to um, I want to um, you know link to benefits page. Here we go. Perfect. Uh, so option number one would be to highlight uh, the text you want to link to and uh, click on this link, hyperlink uh, button over here. And what actually happens, so uh, look, uh, first of all, I could go behind the scenes to that HR benefits page and paste the URL. So that's an option. Uh, but another cool thing is that it actually tries to match the content all right, of whatever you typed in here as text to the content of the other pages. And look at this. Uh, it was smart enough to recognize that um, I have this uh, word benefits here, and it also happens to be the title of my other page. So it actually suggested to me to link to this page. And by the way, here's the URL of that page. Uh, but again, I could just easily grab it from uh, by going to site pages library, uh, all right, and clicking on the page. But here we go. I don't need to do a thing. Here we go. It pretty much, you know, you just uh, click on the page you want to link to or paste the URL, it automatically does so for me, very convenient. And uh, by the way, I can also you know, check this box so it opens up in the new tab. Uh, but um, this time around, we don't need to. So here we go, uh, click Save, and let's just publish it. And here is our linked page, just to show you, look at this, I link to that other page, very, very convenient. Um, that was option number one. Uh, I also want to uh, link to that other page uh, that I have uh, called um, HR policies. And uh, let me show you trick number two. So you click edit button. Uh, so remember with that option, um, I kind of had to, uh, had to um, um, you know, type in the text and then uh, you know, highlight it and click this uh, uh, hyperlink button. The second option, don't do that. With the second option, just type in the two square brackets, all right, on your keyboard. And look at this. It actually will come up uh, with a dropdown of all available pages that I have on my site. And I'll just choose conveniently HR policies, and I'm done. All right, you see, I did not even need to do a thing. I could just, you know, pretty much, uh, pretty much just select it from the available pages. It automatically populated. It automatically linked it for me. The only thing I need to do is just publish my page, and I'm done. And of course, just to prove that we did it, here we go. I click, and here is my link page. Uh, so these were the two tricks I wanted to show you today. Hopefully, you learned something new today. Uh, I really love those tricks, and. Um, uh, hopefully you will do so as well. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.